Hello there, Sagittarius. This is your reading for the month of March 2024. Got some water here because I don't want to lose my voice. And let's get the party started. All right, Sagittarius, you're feeling a little frustrated with people. Perhaps even a little let down by them. And I just keep seeing a snake in the grass. Now, it could be that you are the snake in the grass. You're like, maybe there's some uh, dishonesty happening because you're trying to protect yourself. So you're trying to be just playing it cool. Um, if there is any cheating happening that is, is like a, a Sag that's cheating, this may get busted this month. Um, or if it's somebody who you feel like is, is being dishonest or disloyal or unfaithful, that will come blowing out of the water this month. It just, you know, uh, it does feel like that you're, you're just kind of taking a slow, easy pace this month. Now, I do see something, something with real estate with you. Uh, it does feel like that if you are buying a house, really, really, really be aware of who you trust with the process. Not buying the house process, but like the um, home repairs or make sure that you get an inspection done because owners will say anything to sell their homes. I hate to say it, but it's true. And so make sure you get a good inspection and you have the ability to see that for yourself. Do your research. Again, same thing if you are um, in a relationship. Do your research. You know, it, you are somebody who loves love. And especially if you're the Leo, it just feels like the, the two of you are kind of like, I love you. I love you. I love you. I love you. But you're also going, mm, that person over there looks pretty good. Nope, nope, nope. I'm with you. I'm with you. You know what I mean? So, um, and I'm not accusing anybody of cheating. I'm just saying that if there, if there is something happening, it will be discovered or it insinuated that it's going on. Um, so in regards to health, I do feel like there is some anxiety in the chest and ears, the ears, um, something with the ears, like the sinus and the ear, maybe you're having some allergy issues. Um, I do feel like it is a good money making opportunity, um, month for you, but it's almost like you're just sitting back and watching the money come in. You're not really working too hard. You're just kind of doing your job, doing what you need to do. Nothing extra, nothing like you're not like working really hard, fast paced. You're just kind of like just money come on to me. Money comes easily. Money flows into me. Money flows through me. That's kind of the thing that you're going through right now. That's your mantra. I do feel like that uh, there might be some circulatory issues in the legs as well. If you have like um, pins and needles kind of thing in the legs, that may be the case as well. Um, there's something about somebody reaching out from the past, uh, an old friend or an old partner or somebody from the family that maybe you've disconnected from. Uh, I keep seeing like an old photo. So it's like you remember this person in a certain way, but they've actually changed into a different persona. So maybe you, maybe you idolize this person and you're like, you don't really seem as nice and honest as you used to be. Or, oh wow, you used to be kind of a jerk and now you're actually kind of okay. Um, don't doubt your first instincts this month, Sages. It's really important for you to trust yourself and hold yourself at a high accountability, but also hold others in that same fashion. And speaking of fashion, this month is a really, really nice time for you to kind of work those bolder colors into your wardrobe, the blues, the golds, the greens, the grays. And the, the crystal that I see you working with this month, if you're with crystals, is blue aventurine. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, green aventurine and blue calcite. My apologies. Green aventurine and blue calcite. Bringing that prosperity to that creativity as well. And also the honest and the truth. Um, I also see some honey calcite possibly as well. I also feel like that you have a, a lot to say. 
a lot to spill, a lot of information, just make sure that you filter it for your audience. And you don't have to share everybody everything with everybody. And if anything is given to you, any information is given to you, knowledge is power. And with great power comes great responsibility. That's it for me. Check your sun, moon, and rising, my loves. And if you'd like to book a reading with me, then you can visit me at www.kindredinsights.com for your personal reading. Thank you so much, Sagittarius, and I'll see you next month.